Hi everyone, welcome to day eight of my countdown to Valentine's Day. So it's gonna be my fourth day in a row having a little sip of wine. So I'm excited to have you here. And um, yes, yeah, so my wine is from Wine Kisses and Valentine Wishes from Sip and Savor. Just a really, really fun idea. And um, so today, along with that, I thought I would share with you some sweaters that I got in a Shane, kind of like a mini haul. That's all I bought was three sweaters because I'd never shopped there before, but I had heard so many good things about it and their prices that I thought I would uh, give them a try. So I hope that you stick around and join me. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to see you guys again tonight. So thank you so much everyone. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. Um, the fact that you guys take a few minutes out of your day to spend with me, it just it really does mean a lot to me. So thank you everyone from the bottom of my heart. If you are new to my channel, I hope that you would take a second and just kind of click that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join me for future videos. And today we are continuing with our countdown to Valentine's. So we have got wine from Wine Kisses and Valentine Wishes. So just a really cute little kit from Sip and Savor. There's four different types of wine that came in here, three bottles of each, and so we have already had four bottles. We're going to start again with the first one that I had, so I'm excited to be doing that and sharing it with you. But I thought um, I would start off with doing some sweaters that I got from Shane, and I had never stopped there before, shopped there before, and I'd seen a couple of people do some um, hauls, some clothing hauls, and some home goods and things like that, so I thought I would give them a try. I went online, and I found a couple of sweaters that I liked that were on sale, so um, they've been sitting in, on my spare bed in the other room for about a month now, so I thought this would be a good time to uh, take them out put them on, try them on, and then show it to you. So I bought three different sweaters, really great prices. This one is the first one. It was a $22 sweater, and I got it for $12.99. And again, it's this animal print, so it kind of, it's got a nice little v-neck, but it's not too low. I've got this animal print here. It's not a crop length, but it's just right about the hips. We've got a little bit of ribbing right here. And then just that animal print, and it's just a, uh, just a fun little sweater. I really am cold right now. It's, I feel like I want to go put a turtleneck under here, so I may just do that. But I'm going to go get the other sweater, and I will be right back. And I'm back with the second sweater. So this one was another $22 sweater. It was on sale for $9. It's got this detachable little collar right here so that if you wanted to wear a necklace or something, you could. Or if you wanted to kind of keep your neck warm. It's kind of it's a nice idea. So again, this is another V-neck sweater. It's got the drop shoulders, which um, yeah, I, I don't know if I'm really fond of that look because it just kind of makes me look like I've got no shoulders and kind of sloppy looking. But I do like the sweater. It's just a lot of fun. It kind of goes at an angle, or maybe it's my body that's making it go at an angle. But so it's got a little bit of a detail there. Again, it's got a nice ripped cuff, nice sleeves. This one's got a little bit longer length, and it just looks like a lot of fun to wear, so I think I like this collar. This is, it's just something different. It just kind of gives it a kind of special look, so I'm excited to do this, and we got one more sweater to go. Alrighty, and so I'm back with the third sweater. So again, this, this sweater was $24. This one is super, super soft. It's kind of like the color blocking, so it's got this nice pastel pink up here, and again, we kind of got that kind of dropped kind of shoulder look. We've got some animal print and then some black. Sleeves are nice and long because it's cold. And I did get all these in a size medium. Um, I like extra room in my sweater sometimes in the winter. I know a lot of people when they talk about layering, um, they put on just a camisole when it's 30 degrees below here. I've got another sweater that I would wear under here, another turtleneck. So um, yeah, so it's got like the animal print in the middle. It's got the black on the bottom. This one's a little bit longer. I don't think it's long enough to be able to wear with leggings, but for jeans, it looks okay. And it's just nice and soft. And so it's nice that I ended with pink for the Valentine's. So again, yeah, so this was uh, $12 um, 
and this sweater would have been $24 so just some nice things from there um, if these are still available like I said it was a month ago over probably over a month ago that I bought these so if they are still available I'll, uh, I'll have the link below for you and I just want to show you I added another palette today to the giveaway so I just want to show you those but I'll show you the one that I already put in there because I just kind of held this up but I didn't show you the inside I probably did when I got it and it could have been from BoxyCharm, could have been from Ipsy. It's the OPV Beauty. And there are some really, some pretty colors in here. So I think you can get some fall looks in here. I think with the lighter colors you could get a nice spring look, something kind of light, something dramatic. So that is the uh, first palette that's in here. And the one that I put in today, I bought specifically to go in a giveaway. I didn't know which one I was going to put it in. And um, this is one that I had already, but I love using this palette. I probably should have used it today, but I used browns today. So this is a hip dot palette. And it's got some, some pretty colors in here. From like purples and kind of cranberry. Some gold. So I think that one's, that's a pretty palette too. That nice peachy color and some gold. It just really makes some really nice looks and I don't do dramatic looks because I don't know how but if you know how I, I bet you can work wonders with these palettes so don't know what else I'm going to be adding but I know I've got a few more days to add to that so I'm looking forward to adding some more goodies to the giveaway box and um, so again we're going to um, have a code word and yeah, last night I forgot I had to come back on and do it so before I go I will think of a word. But anyway, because I've got all the animal prints on today, I thought I would use my Robin with a Y fine glass with her animal print and her Swarovski. I didn't even really put any jewelry on today. And the wine, we're back to like day one where we had that rosé wine. And um, I haven't had rosé wine in a couple of years. And I think um, the last one I bought, I bought it. Like, I don't know really anything about wines but this bottle was just so so pretty and I was thinking it was a light sweet wine and it would be perfect for sitting outside in the summer and the bottle was so pretty and oh my gosh it it was horrible it was so dry and just blah there was like no real flavor to it I ended up mixing it with some sparkling water just to be able to drink it because I did not want to dump it down the drain. Sometimes you just get tired of dumping things down the drain because you don't like them. So anyway, this one is a nice rosé. It's a nice pink, pink pretty color. And I'm sure it's the same mixture that I had the other night. I doubt if they would put different uh, varieties in the bottle. So again it's just it's a dry wine but it was a light dry it wasn't like something that uh, like a heavy heavy red wine just very very light Had some nice flavors that were in it there was like cherry some raspberry some strawberry just really flavorful so cheers everyone happy another day closer to valentine's day mm, so it is so good <coughs> So, in keeping with the first day, I saved this one cupcake. I really am amazed I kept this cupcake so long. It is probably going to be stale, but you know what? If it is, I'll just zap it in the microwave for a second or two and make it soft again. So, it's just from the local grocery store. I bought a mini pack of six. I should have bought the 12 or the pack of 24, but they would all be gone by now, and I would be feeling sorry for myself that I ate them all. So, the code word today to use to be entered in today's giveaway, well, it'll be the one at the end, but the one that you have to use, and again, all the uh, rules will be in the description below, and they're just all the normal rules that everybody else has. The most important being that you do have to be publicly subscribed to my channel. And I know a lot of people probably think they are because I see the same ones um, using the code words but when I go to check they're either not publicly subscribed to me or they're not publicly subscribed to anyone so that is one of the huge ones that you really do have to watch out for and so the code word today is going to be cupcake yeah so I'm excited about that and 
happy to be finishing this last cupcake and that I didn't whoop them all down the same day but that I bought them and I'm really excited to have you guys here I'm excited that I finally tried these sweaters on and I can put them away in my closet and start wearing them yeah so yeah so I hope you guys go out tomorrow have a great day we are Monday first day down in the week so we are one day closer to Friday that's the best way to look at it one day closer to Friday so thanks everyone we'll talk to you soon love you guys bye bye